Hey guys, welcome to JVS Academy. In this video, I'll show you how to create FTP accounts and how to connect to FTP server with by using some uh, FTP clients. So let's get started. Go ahead and log in into your cPanel. This is my cPanel dashboard. Once you enter into this dashboard, in under the file section, you'll be able to see this FTP accounts button over here. If you are not able to see this, then just click on the search box above and type FTP and you will get this option here. Right? Click it on, click on this. Yeah. In this page, you will be able to see all the FTP accounts if you have created previously. Right now, as you can see, there is one FTP account right now, which is known as rakeshantharajgwdomisites.com and let us go ahead and create one more for this tutorial ftp go reels add the name for this account username for the account and enter your password you can assign the password Also, you can use this password generator button to generate a complex password for yourself. Right? And here in directory, make sure you can uh, you can select the directory path over here. Right now, gww.demosites.com is a root. It's not public underscore HTML. It's a root for my server. And then in that, there will be a directory created. Automatically, this directory will be created with the name FTP Tutorials. There is no directory right now it will auto create this directory for us if you have any specific path you can enter it right enter it here that's not a problem and here you can assign the quota for this particular ftp account right now i'll keep it unlimited and hit create ftp account account has been created successfully congratulations now if you scroll down here you will you can see the new FTP account which has been created just now and how to connect to the FTP server and start transferring the files uh, you need to check here you will have this fourth option called as configure FTP client click on this and these are the details that you will be needing FTP username FTP server which is also known as host and then FTP explicit port number 21 If you are using these FTP clients such as Core FTP for Windows or CyberDuck for Mac, then you can directly download these files and run. If not, like me, uh, currently I'm using WinSCP. So let me show you by connecting to the server. This is the username. Username has to go here. And server FTP at the FTP dot gwdemosites.com. Host name is correct. And then explicit 21. Or else you can leave it as it is if you don't have SSL certificate installed in uh, on your cPanel there is no SSL certificate let, uh, let it be by default as it is if you have SSL you can select this option and then enter password click on save ok Select the name. And then hit enter. Hit OK. And then now you can select this. You can see there are two uh, credentials that are that has been saved. This is the older one, and this is the one which we just now created. And click on login. Now you'll be asked to enter the password again. 
and enter. This is it guys, you successfully connected to the server and to test it, let's go to cPanel and open file manager. Find the directory of FTP, here it is gww.com and here is the directory which has been created just now freshly due to FTP account and let me open this one. As you can see there is empty directory here. Let's add some files from our local computer to this server, to this cPanel account. And from the left side you can copy files and just drag it and paste it here. This, the right side is of server and the left side is of our local computer. I hope you already know it and uh, just verify, minimize and here come back to cPanel and reload it. Okay, done. So these files have been successfully transferred. Let me delete a file here. Let's see if it is deleted here. If you refresh, you can see yeah, you can see the files available on the server as well in that particular directory. There is no file, there is one file itself. We just not deleted from CPAL. It's two way, it works two way from two way, and you can again add this file here and can come back to cPanel and reload it again you got that file right this is how we work we can create FTP accounts and this is how you connect to FTP um, directory using some FTP clients and yeah thank you very much for watching stay tuned till then we'll see you in the next video thank you